Ugh, we all hate seeing these ugly things, right? Maybe a page is missing, an entire site is missing, or maybe we simply typed in a URL wrong. Could happen to anyone, including your visitors. Now this may not seem like a big deal, but in today's fast-paced ADD landscape, it could be the death knell of traffic to your site. Or okay, if that's too dramatic, then at least we can agree on the fact that it's an eyesore and a potential turnoff to your site's visitors. Especially if you've got something that looks like this. Ugh. You've done all that work to streamline your site's look and functionality, you've optimized images, done every trick in the book to reduce HTTP requests, your page load times are as quick as lightning, you've got sweet responsiveness on mobile devices, a real thing of beauty. Then one fat thumb hits the wrong key, and all that work goes right out the window. You never get a second chance to make a first impression, and this hideous image is indelibly printed under the brain of a potential client. But let's turn that frown upside down. Give me just a minute here to convince you why it's a great idea to have a custom 404 error page. Like, let's say, this one. From uh, gross, to ah, nice. For one, having a custom 404 will help prevent users from navigating away from your website, and therefore increasing your bounce rate and hurting your search engine rankings. You want to make sure that they continue browsing on your site, and at the very least, find what they were originally looking for. Better yet, if they don't have to rummage around and spend time looking too hard for it. Second, a custom 404 is yet another opportunity to further brand your site, and that's always a good thing. You can use it to boost your charm and creativity. It simply feels better to your users to fall into the safe arms of your custom page. It promotes trust. You can have fun with it, keep things playful, or heck, you can even use it as another opportunity to put your message out, to convert leads, and so on. For example, there's this ugly thing, or the clever 404 for this film studio, or this one, this classic, or the 404 for a dating website, a cute one for Airbnb. Now there's no rule that it says it has to be over the top on the creative side, some award-winning design. It can also simply be functional and straightforward, including a link to your homepage. It's up to you. But there's really no good argument against having your own custom 404 page, something that fits your brand and message, and helps the user get back from the wilderness and find whatever it is on your site they were looking for. In short, you don't want the 404 to be a dead end for the user. You want it to offer a solution, to maintain brand familiarity and trust. In fact, you can make it an opportunity by dazzling them with other product offers, a call to action, Using Google's Search API to offer targeted URLs from your site, that's a slick one. Or if you want to get really involved, you can even employ exit intent technology to create a pop-up when the user is about to abandon your 404 page, thus increasing conversions and reducing bounce rate. How's that for fancy? Now to make a custom 404 page is as simple as can be. Like any other page on your site, go ahead and design it in line with the rest of your site's look and messaging, or however you see fit. You can add links to important pages on your site. You can display any special offers you have going. You can include a site map, a search box, a contact form. The sky's the limit here. It's really up to you. Just don't blame your visitors for coming to this page. In fact, an apology often goes a long way in making them feel warm and fuzzy about you and your site. But we at least recommend that it hits some key targets. That it clearly tells the visitor that the page they're looking for can't be found that it looks and feels like the rest of your website. After all, you might be jumping the shark if you go all out designing the greatest custom 404 page in history, but in being way too clever, site visitors don't know that it's part of your website, as opposed to some random page that has no association with your brand or message. Again, consider having some links to important pages on your site, or at the very least, a link directly back to your homepage. If you've got a sprawling site with lots of pages, like maybe an e-commerce site with hundreds of product pages, then maybe it's a good idea to set up a way for users to report the broken link. Maybe in that case, you'll find that a very common typo is causing a lot of users' headaches. And from there, maybe a clever solution is in order, such as duplicating that page with the commonly mistyped URL and using a canonical tag to automatically redirect users to the quote-unquote real URL. You get the idea. By putting in the proper work here, you can turn a simple mistake to your advantage with a custom 404 page. So, once you have it ready, let's look at how to put it to use on your site. If you have a hosting package that comes with its own 404 that already pops up when you type in a site URL that doesn't exist, 
then the process is as simple as can be. Just design your custom page, name it 404.html, and save it in the root directory of your website. And now if a visitor types in an old URL of your domain that doesn't exist anymore, makes a typo, and so on, they'll get your delightful, useful, custom 404 page instead of that ugly old thing. If you don't already have this set up on your server, then we're going to need to take an extra step here. Don't worry if you've never done this before, it's a cakewalk. The best method is to locate your HT access file, which is typically a hidden file by default, so make sure you can see your hidden files. Then edit it, add this line that includes the path to your custom 404 page, and save. And you should be all set to go. Go ahead and type in a non-existent site URL, and you should see your custom 404 in all its splendid glory. Feel free to check out our other videos so you can keep fine-tuning and getting the most out of your SEO. And click subscribe to stay updated with new tips and tricks to get you to the top of the search engine results pages.